you have no idea how grateful Ian and Donna are that you did what you had to do to be here right now. They will try and express it to you individually, but it might be a little difficult to fully convey. Projecting love and joy is a full body activity, which is why dancing is emphasized. So in some ways, the chupa ceremony, what we're doing right now, is just the pregame for the dancing and the joy <laughs> we're getting ready to project on both of you, Bezrat Hashem, on your wedding day. I dropped her off at the doctor's office on Monday morning. I'm imagining so many future moments of happiness with you. The first, when I see you across the room today for our bedeckin. I imagine the tingle I feel when I see you at the end of every day, but magnified. So my funny thing is, I'm the oldest sister, I'm the athletic one. Ian owns all of his athletic ability to me. <laughs> Ian said, Donna's devotion to family is beautiful. Almost every Friday morning, she calls her Bubby in Israel to wish her a good Shabbos. She loves her family very much. It will be an amazing mother when the time comes. <laughs> his humor, his stories, his questions are so delightful. I laugh so much just in falling asleep. That going to bed is one of the most entertaining moments of the day. You might one day marry. I always emphasize that there are only two traits that are truly important. Kindness and generosity. Well, she hit the jackpot with Ian. It's an honor for us twin brothers of Donna to celebrate together with you. A special, special, heartfelt uh, well wishes from the Bubby who loves you both. Thank you for welcoming us so beautifully here and to nature and to your family, Ian, your beautiful family. I'm so happy for the two of you. Uh, Ian, it's been an incredible journey getting to know you. Um, I, I admire you in more ways than you know. Avi and I were just chatting about how there's no one else like Ian Mednick in the world. I remember when uh, you went to on your European trip together in Paris and um, in Israel and when you guys called me and told me that you were engaged and it was so exciting and, and uh, you got to share that with our Bubby who just celebrated her 96th birthday. I think a very important part of what makes you two special is your love for your family. The moment I met her, she would go on about her niece and nephew and brothers and Bubby. I know Bubby well, I think. I've never met her. So we, we think that love for family just brings you guys closer together and and we love you. And really lastly, as my mom told them, by next year they should have a twilling, twins, and maybe even a tripling. Okay. Finally, Donna summed it up. There are moments when I feel like I'm the balloon and Ian is the string. We ground each other while letting the other fly. Donna helped me find my way in New York City. I'm not sure I would have stuck around for her. With Donna, I found adventure right in Brooklyn. And, and as the years progress, I know with Nelly and myself, your life turns out really good. Things work out. Not only do they work out, it's a fake, it pounds your heart. Your heart beats because it is so internal and so wonderful as you feel your love today for each other. Uh, it, will, it will just continue for many, many years and it will grow and grow. I have never spent time with two people who stop to smell the flowers, make sure that they look into each other's eyes. Um, so I am super happy for you. I think you guys are awesome. Wow. that you two found each other.
each other. You're perfect for each other. And I'm so happy they're going to be living close to us in Brooklyn. And we're just going to be one big happy family. Oh, hi. Hi. He looks so beautiful. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I imagine your hair growing gray, your heart growing only bigger as we grow our family. Gorgeous. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, incredible. Yes.